Have you ever had racist people? I have in not your had circle? racist people in my circle, and if there are, I usually disassociate from them. Mm -hmm. I've had people treat me differently because I'm gay, but I don't care because I'm Jake. Jake. Dariana. Black Lives Matter. I know. Let's be real. I'm so sick of hearing about all the racist injustice and people being treated differently because of their skin tone. Like, I'm gay and Dariana is black and I'm white. We've never had a problem getting along Not from the get go. Not at all. I think it's click the, fucking tight. I think it's I think it's a learned a learned behavior. Well let's let's unlearn or, it. Or or also I feel like it's just like an authority thing for um, Caucasians as well. It's it's bad that I have you ever had racist people? I have in your not circle? had racist people in my circle and if there are I usually disassociate from them. Mm -hmm. I've had people treat me differently because I'm gay, but I don't care because I'm Jake. Mm -hmm. But I just feel bad. I get nervous. Like I worry about you guys and I just think all this is stupid and it does not even need to be mm -hmm. a thing. Like I don't care. I don't care if we glow in the dark. Just be a good person. Yeah. Just At the end of the day I feel like um like with the whole rioting and things like that, I also feel like um people they don't they don't understand us that's why you know what i'm saying that's why they choose to say what they want to say about us um just like in grand rapids recently somebody some two two um african americans passed away rest in peace their soul two african americans passed away um and then a caucasian made a statement and said another um two african american lot no he said something like another he said two two more african-american lives that did not matter and you want to know what the city did the city went to his house put a tent up uh had food and it was just out there i just feel like it's net it's sad to us because That's we always sad. we always get the end of the stick um and i feel like it's a lot of behavior although there's some people who who are not even addressing it and i feel like they're i feel like they're they're them not saying nothing is an issue for me. I'm very simple with it. Um, and that's what I, 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 I wish we could agree to disagree. I don't care if you're black, white, Asian, Latino, transgender, gay, lesbian, curious, uh, fat, small, short, tall. I don't care. Like, if you're cool, I'm cool. Like, And I have people that I can agree to disagree with. Hey, we just have the different opinions on things mm -hmm. that doesn't mean i'm going to create a divide whatever right. you have your opinion i have mine let's just leave it at that yeah. so we need to do that and quit this bullshit i just think it's when, when they it's look at us when they look at african-americans coming from a coming from a caucasian male don't take offense to this when they you won't. look at an african-american what do you see jake a person what do you feel what do you feel? Like, I don't say Dariana, my black friend. I say my friend Dariana. True enough. Do you feel like when people say, um, what, what, how do you feel when, when, Af I mean, when Caucasians say, I have, I have black friends, I'm not racist? I think there is a little bit of racist tied, racism tied to it. The fact that you felt the need to go out of your way mm -hmm. to say, Right, I have a black friend. I have black friends. Okay, then have your black friends and shut the fuck up. Like, right. who cares? Yeah. That's why I'm like, if I was going to have you over the one day, I'm not going to be like, you guys, my friend Dariana's coming over to date. She's black. Right. No. It's, it's, I'm like, Dariana's coming over. Yeah. I think I think not, just like, just like a lot of people are saying, not every... Caucasian is racist and not, not racist every cop is a bad racist cop but at the end of the day this is something that needs to be spoken about this is it's something disgusting. that needs yeah, it's really is, disgusting and it shows it shows in the criminal justice field it shows um it's disgusting it shows in people's lives it's, it's really sad like our opportunities that that we get are not the same as Caucasians just like when, when we're well let's not use work but in a sense African Americans don't get the same treatment as Caucasians. Can, can you agree? Um, 
Yes and no. I don't like to look at it like that, though. I like mm -hmm. to think everyone... I, in a perfect world, I like to envision that no matter what you look like, your color, whatever, in a perfect world, my mind says everyone will be treated equal. But unfortunately, that's not the case. Yeah. And then, like, the like I I don't know I don't know it's hard for me to you know even like I don't have hope like I I have hope for everybody to be treated equally but okay. I feel like it's not gonna happen. He needs to put a shirt on. Yeah, he does. Sorry, you know we're not racist. We'll never be racist. I'll never be racist. Mm -hmm. um, I wish I had a million dollars or I wish I had a hundred million dollars so I could just get back. Cause this is bullshit right now. Can I have that? Can I have a hundred million? Yeah, I don't think I got it. Cut a band! Why? Because bands make bands. Period. Bands make bands. But listen bands. though, he played too much. But listen though, we just wanted to come together and um, I did, I wanted to ask Jake, you know, a few questions and we wanted to start off with that Black Lives Matter um, little quote thing due to the fact that all Caucasians aren't against this. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? If you go downtown, if you were looking at the, the, the movement and things like that, there was a lot of Caucasians down there fighting for us. And it's so many, it's so many, so many of them yeah. fighting for us. It's so many of us fighting for each other so that this doesn't happen. But it's going to take a while and it's, and it's going to take time for things to adjust with us. But I'm just saying now, it's, I, I'm, I'm blessed to have a friend like Jake. I'm, I'm blessed to have a person in my life like I'm Jake. You know what I'm saying? Ariana. And at the end of the day love you you don't you don't there's no color when it comes to love there's no color when it comes to coming together um or unity you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying so you should people should be open minded um just be i know i noticed that some people um are are upset at caucasians you shouldn't be mad at everybody you know what i'm saying there's there's some people who yeah there there's some people who spoils it for the whole bunch but you have to be open minded to certain things you better not put that gun back in your mouth. <laughs> okay, at the end of the day, please, can we come together? We're already we're already dealing with corona. Um, now we got riots, racism, Trump's a cunt. We're all just people at the end of the day trying to do the best we can. Let's stop. 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 Just stop. We're done. No, we're done. Hit. Done. Go like this, Jake. Doing it right. uh, Thank y'all for watching. Make sure y'all smash the like button, comment down below, hit that post notification bell so you can know whenever we post a video. Uh, um, the reason why I got blood on my shirt, um, it's actually a good statement. You know what I'm saying? What if the police beat me up? But no, I'm just playing. But um, I just did a prank on him, so this this is gonna this is gonna drop before I drop the prank. Um, but at the end of the day, I just wanted to talk to y'all. Um, keep giving y'all content. And just go from there. Love y'all. Love you. Ooh, love you. I'm a little scratchy.